Hey, St. Louis, thank you for tuning in to STL TV. I'm Angela Hockman, and with me today is Keisha Candé, here to tell us more. Did I say the last name right? You I hope did, it's a fun you one. We're going to talk about the upcoming Role Models Fashion Exhibit. This is going down on Sunday, April 24th. Keisha, yes. thank you for coming by. You're welcome. Thank you for having me. I yeah. might geek out because I am a super fan okay. of the Woke brand. Awesome. Thank and you so much. <laughs> of course. Yep. Talk to me a little bit about how and why you started the Woke brand. All right. Um, I got started with the Woke brand as a form of expression. Mm -hmm. I was looking for outlets of how to uh, just tell my story without, you know, really being judged. I started going to open mics here locally in St. Louis. Shout out to the open mic platforms okay. out here. Okay. <laughs> um, and I started literally just getting on stage, letting it out. All right. It became a form of therapy for me. Um, one thing led to another. Next thing you know, somebody said, hey, I want to book you. I'm rocking my Book Me t-shirt, okay, by the way. I you love see that it. In you are there. in demand. Okay. <laughs> and then from there, I started putting some of my famous quotes, right, on t-shirts and uh, just started expressing from there. And one thing led to another from there. And somebody said, hey, can you make me a jacket? Hey, can you make this? Can you make that? And I literally just tried. And from one, one, one leap of faith to the next, there it was, uh, the Woke brand oh was gosh. birthed, and it is now known for three reasons. People know us for poetry, they know us for eclectic, sold-out, dope events, <laughs> and they know us for our, our high fashion, which is very, very loud, bold, and welcoming to all people. And the acronym itself stands for Let's Wake Up, Stay Open and Optimistic, Keep Connected with Everyone Everywhere. Oh, my gosh. That's like way above and beyond a regular <laughs> mission statement. Yeah, 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 yeah. So all of this started from a form of self-expression. Absolutely. Poetry. Absolutely. And you fused it into the fashion world. It mm -hmm. sounds like they're both both passions. Absolutely. And you get to do both yes. for a living. Yes. Yep. Walked away from my corporate job five years ago. Just drop the mic there. Say, you yep, there you go. And uh, <laughs> give it a run. Give it a, give it a test for myself to see what I'm capable of doing. Yeah. And uh, alongside of, you know, uh, God's light and, 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 and all of what he has instilled in me, I have just, you know, knocked down every ounce of a, of a situation that has appeared, right. you know, and just conquering it and learning more about myself and being able to, you know, push through. So I tell anybody where you have a starting point to definitely go beyond the thought, you know, actually try it. But it's so scary. It <laughs> I think is. A lot of it people is. are like, have an idea. What if it doesn't work? What if I don't have Absolutely. money to fund it? I bund it. I, I, I literally battled that so many times. And in <sighs> fact, I'm asked that question very frequently inside the store. You know, people come in and they say, how did you know that this was it? And I didn't know. And it's that part that's wow. the truth that I want people to know, you know, that you don't always know. Yeah. You don't always have a business plan. And you can't always write everything out and say that it's going to work. But... You can always find what you love and mm. you can always tap into your own peace. And so when you get to that space, that is a conscious state of being, which is why we named the company The Woke Brand. And right? let's talk about the feeling of being woke. Okay. Explain the experience of walking into the store, which is at the St. Louis Galleria, yes. for the first time. Yes. So if you come into the Galleria Mall, Cheesecake Factory entrance, we're on the first level. Okay. Uh, when you walk into this store, uh, first of all, we wake you up with all the loud colors. <laughs> all right. I love bling. I love rhinestone. Um, this room is filled with fashions for men, women, and children to make oh. sure that we are welcoming all people, all sizes as well. We go all the way up to 5X. All right, so between the colors, the hats, when Unlimited the Poet performs, she always wears fedoras. So we have a funky yes. hat section inside the store where you can find all of the things that you wouldn't typically see in the mall. They're in our I store. Mean, and I've yeah. seen you on the Daily Mix, and yeah. you had this awesome yellow hat with yeah. safety pins. And I uh -huh. think Angela There's Sharp a and I might have to thumb roll uh -huh. or thumb floor <laughs> for it. It was so cool. Thank you. So people can come in and simply buy off Absolutely. the rack. Absolutely. You can or buy designer freestyles. You can buy designer picks, which are just garments that I think are cool enough and dope enough with their own creativity to just put on the hangers. Or we carry blank items. And so with those blank items, mm. there it is. There's that room for you to come in. You're the designer. You get to pick. <sighs> you pick your color. You pick your size. You can mix and match it. It's really cool. I mean, and we get to learn people beyond the clothes. Like, yes. in that moment, it's called a design consultation, but we're really, like, having an amazing time.
Stop it. So you empower your guests to be part of the design process. Absolutely. I have never seen that in my life. Absolutely. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. We breaking, we breaking through. Oh We're waking people up. And I always gosh. tell people when they walk out the door, stay woke, my friends, and go wake a city up near you. <laughs> and that is one of your rockin' hashtags, correct? Absolutely. Stay woke, my friends. And if you look up the hashtag, you'll always find like our client photos. Oh. They always use the hashtag and then we can share it on our own social medias. And it's just, it's almost like a real, real friendship, you know, yeah. with the people who come in and choose to shop with us. And you are building such an important and special community. Thank you. And you are empowering people to, like you said, come as you are, no judgment, yep. get creative, yep. have fun. You know, we got one life to live. And challenge me. <laughs> yeah. Challenge me by all means as the lead designer. There's some things that people come in and say, hey, can you do it? And I've never done it before. But guess what? I never signed up to be here five years ago. Right. <laughs> you know what I mean? None so, of us did. Right. So it's just like go with the wind and try it. In yeah. some scenarios, I say, hey, can you trust me? Do you trust me? Mm -hmm. And then in mm -hmm. some other scenarios, they're like, what are you thinking? I'm like, uh, you got to make that call. Yeah. But I always welcome people to challenge me as well. At some point, you mm -hmm. know, you have to trust yourself enough, trust uh -huh. your gut. You're like, no, if I don't know, I can figure it out. And if not, yep. surround myself with these awesome experts that can absolutely, help. Absolutely, absolutely. Keisha, So you grateful have... for my team, too. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm so grateful for them. A big event coming up. Yes. And we're not calling this a fashion show. Let's be very clear. Absolutely. This is a role models fashion exhibit. Exhibit, absolutely. Walk me through it. Okay, What's going so, on? Okay, so, you know, I wanted to get away from the regular models on the runway. Uh, because they know the Woke brand for three reasons. Business, mentorship, poetry, the shows, you know. I say, you know what? Let's go get some dope role models in St. Louis City and turn them into our models on the runway. And whatever business they bring, let's bring that to the room. Let's make that the light in the forefront of things. And let's add fashion and let's add poetry, and let's oh add gosh. art. I love art. I love watching live art. Me too. I mean, So people just, are literally going to oh, be painting. Yes, yes. Uh, and I love pole oh. dancers. I think that they are just, they possess something that I don't have. I don't even know where <laughs> it comes from. Yes. And I just love watching the art of oh. pole. And so we'll definitely have that. We'll even have oh a live gosh. band, because I want to entertain all people that will come to this room. Okay. Wow. Uh, we never want to leave out anybody. That's a big piece of the woke oh. brand. Everyone, everywhere. I love that. Thank Inclusion you. is everything. Absolutely. I mean, yeah, to just be that community for people, mm -hmm. which woke brand is and yep. you are, is astounding. Thank you. And there is. We've got a special STL TV feature yes. at the fashion show. Our own Meg O is yep. one of the hosts. Absolutely. Megan, now she's oh. about to kill it. I, of she's course she is. She's about to kill That's it. That's what she Megan brings does. The energy. She is just uh, the light itself. And so that's what we need inside this room. We need people that are going to bring that warm, welcome energy, hold down the fun inside, you know what I mean? Yeah. And then after that, the rest is history. They'll talk about it. I get it. I love it. So do you have anything exciting on the on the forefront? Like what we got to say some next? of it. You just got to get your tickets yeah. now. OK, OK, OK. <laughs> you got to stay woke, my friend. But for the most part, you can expect an evening that is definitely fully loaded with experience. OK, OK. That's that's what I want people to know on the front side. And you probably want to buy a ticket uh, for the next show right away when you leave. OK, you mm -hmm. heard it first. Get yep. your tickets ASAP. They are flying yes. literally. A about yep. to be only standing room only. Yes. You gotta plan shoes for events that are standing room. <laughs> um, make sure you check out the Role Models Fashion Exhibit. Again, it's Sunday, April 24th, mm -hmm. 7 to midnight. Yep. Oh, I don't even want to know it's all loaded. the things you can pack into those five hours. It's loaded. It is going down at the St. Louis Galleria. You can get more information at www.rolemodels22.eventbrite.com. Dot com. Okay, run, don't walk there because I said go. tickets are flying. <laughs> you can also check out shopwokebrand.com. Uh -huh, see all the website. things that Keisha is doing. You are unstoppable. You Thank are you. electric. Thank you. We are honored to have you here at STL TV. Thank you for having Thank me. Thank you. You're welcome. For coming. <laughs> um, we are so excited to learn more, follow more, see what the heck you are up to next. I think yep. you're just going to be doing fierce things there all the time. There it is. Stay woke, my friends. Stay woke, my hey. friends. You heard it first. <laughs> Again, if you would like tickets, these things are flying, so get them now. Make sure you visit rolemodels22.eventbrite.com or simply shop wokebrand.com.
www.ruffleshoes.com. You can buy things on the website. I saw these super yep. cute jeans with the ruffles on the so side. So yeah, we're getting you like, in the store. That's what's going to happen next. I you got to get in there. Field trip. I'll yep. bring my little girl. She will love all the colors oh, and everything. She's going to love it. So <laughs> check them out on social media. Also check out stltv.net. We are also on all those fun social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and of course, YouTube. That is going to do it for us today. We have had a blast here with Keisha. Keep it right here to lock in what's going down in STL, where you get to experience St. Louis. We'll see you next time.